Hey guys, welcome to my C programming tutorial on functions. I'm going to be running you through some functions today uh, that we'll be covering, like their return types and how to declare them um, and what can go wrong. Okay, so you can see this uh, short little C program we have here it doesn't do anything at the moment. Uh, if you don't understand anything in this C program, I suggest you look back on my other C tutorials for some information. Um, as you can see, we have our first uh, function of the day in main. Uh, sorry, the function is called main. It has uh, no parameters and it has a return type of int, as shown here. Okay, so if uh, main returns zero, that means it ran successfully. There wasn't any problems. If it returns non-zero, so anything other than zero, then uh, something went wrong. Uh, that's not a requirement. It's just um, it's just good practice and it's it, it's a convention. Um, so let's do our function. Okay, what we're going to do here is uh, declare a variable, and we're going to ask the user to assign a value to this variable using scanf. Okay, so I assume you remember how to do that. If you don't understand what this is, then I suggest again you look back at my other tutorials. And what we're going to do here is have um, a nice printf function which will print uh, the square of um, x. Okay, so x and square x. Okay, you'll notice here I have a function in uh, the printf statement. Uh, this is perfectly valid and uh, square x will be evaluated um, and the function will be run. Um, if we try and compile this at the moment, sorry, ignore that, um, it will fail saying there's an undefined reference to square. This means uh, that square, uh, the, 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 there's nothing associated with it, it's, it's, it's not a function, it's not a variable, it's not anything, so we need to define it and declare it. So let's do that int square int x and all we're going to do literally is that that is our function it returns x times x all the um, clever stuff is happening here um, it's a perfectly valid statement and it does work so if we run this uh, there's no errors, that's a good sign uh, enter a value, let's do uh, 5 5 squared is 25. Okay, remember formatting is important, so let's do a new line on there. Let's get rid of this. Okay, 5. 5 squared is 25. Uh, 100 squared is 10,000. Minus 1 squared is 1, apparently. Okay. Um, so that's all working hunky dory. Let's, uh, let's get a bit more complicated. What shall we do? Let's multiply two numbers together. Uh, that's not overly complicated. Um, print f uh, d times d is d. Okay, so we do x, y, and multiply x and y. So we have the same deal here. Um, we do need to declare another variable y, and we do need to scan that in as well. Let's do that after we've done the uh, square. Okay, so scan it and shove it in Y. Oops. Okay. Um, now what will happen? Uh, if we compile this, I'll let you take a wild guess before I do it. There we go. Undefined reference to multiply. We have to do declare that function. Okay, so if we do multiply in x and in y and then we did return x times what? that's the one um, that should work so let's try that shall we so 5 squared is 25 and then we want 5 times 10 5 times 10 is 50 ok that's great remember formatting again I don't know why I keep missing that out so we have uh, 100 squared is 10,000, then 100 times minus 3, let's try that, 100 times minus 3 is minus 300, um, yes, that's absolutely fine, that works, 
Uh, let's do a more simple example. 2 times 2 is 4. Okay, so the multiplying function works. Um, as a um, task, uh, I want you to do some division and uh, see if you can do, I don't know, some adding up and some taking away. Okay, so now that we've got that, let's do some decent, let's do some processing in the, uh, now let's do some more statements in the function. Um, let's create a function which requires some, uh, maybe an if statement or something. Um, let's do uh, greater than, uh, it's a very crude example. Um, so now our um, program is going to ask for two numbers and it's going to say which one is the greater number, x and y. I'm reusing the variables, that's absolutely fine. Okay, uh, I'm Rascal 99, blogs at Rascal 99.